want to share with you a very special story. Once upon a time, there was a little girl who accidentally broke a dish and set off a roller coaster of events that eventually led to the publication of this, my very first picture book, The Fix It Man. This little girl's unwavering belief that her dad could fix anything and everything, because he could, got me thinking. I thought, what if one day there was something dad couldn't fix? What if one day dad needed fixing himself? How would a child cope in that situation? Now, I didn't set out to write a picture book about dealing with grief and loss. Well, not initially. But as the words and metaphors and symbols started to spill out, this story grew, as did the realisation and the connection between fixing something physically and emotionally as well. Until I knew I had something very special, despite the fact that the story is essentially about a little girl's sadness at the loss of one of her parents. Now, I think you'll agree that Nikki Johnson's beautiful illustrations are so heartwarming and special. They're the exact right mixture of whimsy and seriousness that help us connect and appreciate this enormous emotion of loss and grief that the little girl is experiencing. It takes us from joy through to heartbreak and then hopefully back to joy and salvation again. And I hope that the Fix-It Man well, for me, is a recognition and an acceptance of the realities of life. And also, a really beautiful look at the special and unique relationship between a father and her daughter. And I hope that The Fixer Man ultimately illustrates to you all that love and patience really do conquer all. Would you like to see a little bit inside? I'll show you. The Fix-It Man. My dad can fix anything. It's what dads do. He's handy with a hammer when my furniture falls apart. He's nifty with a needle and thread. Can untangle knots. I can't. With super glue and broken wings, he is just amazing. Thank goodness Dad is always here for my it was an accident situations. While Dad fixes, I fetch and Mama watches from her rug. The one Dad stitched together from rainbows and old hugs. She's too sore on the inside to help us, but her fingers still work fine. She hooks tiny diamonds into starbursts and snowflakes while Tiger sits close by. Dad makes Mama's bad days better too with his soothing peach and honey brew. Hmm. Look at this. Isn't that beautiful? But well, I'm going to stop there. And I hope that reading books like this one, like The Fix-It Man, help you feel better too, no matter what you're going through, no matter what emotion you're experiencing. And that, I think, is the magic of stories. Now you can read out more about The Fixer Man and find it on the EK Books website or on my website www.dimityPowell.com. So come on and visit. Thanks. See you again soon.